looking to get his head back in the game and uh, wanting to feel the love for competing again. This is uh, the three times and reigning world champion, Patrick Chan. His time to settle down, going through the setup for that triple axle. Now, what's he got in store for us? Again, awfully close to the boards, triple toe, triple toe. There's a delay on that triple axle. Beautiful edge work into that triple Lutz. Well, an absolutely beautiful program. The transitions in that just to die for. But it wasn't technically the quality that we're used to seeing from Mr. Chan. A masterpiece, though. Well, he went into the music, didn't he? Right from the start. It's... Uh, hmm. I don't know how it's been for you, Chris, but if there's a, a, a beautiful bit of music and you're just there and you're creating that moment, you close your eyes, feel the music, breathe, and you're with it. And that's what he did at the start. I think it's a really demanding piece, whether it's in a competition or it's, it was on a, on a stage. Uh, it, it's lovely the way he captures it, the feeling he has within it, the the power he has so that he can take the strong edges. There's a rise and fall with the skating, and then there's this pause, and then he drives in for the speed and builds that up. That very exciting, getting the applause on the step sequence because of the dynamics that the audience was feeling with that, and the, the music by uh, Rachmaninoff just providing that backdrop, and sometimes it's just you just have to hold your breath with him. But it's a big season. It's early in the season and the placement 
of the uh, opening combination it's close to the barrier it certainly was you wonder whether he was going for quad toe in the combination and just backed off made it triple triple A lot of uh, analysis of the performance and the, the pattern on the rink, but uh, I think he'll take that this early on in the season. Canada, they've got three spots in Sochi. There he is setting up the combination, triple toe, triple toe, and just look how close he was to the boards. That must have been pretty scary, not only for him, but the people sat in the front row there. There's the axle, lovely and clean. You love the way out of every element, he's straight into a transition yes. and then a link into the next movement. And this breathing point and then the move into the skating. But just before the takeoff for the combination, he had a look in his eye and I think it was almost like, oh, I'm too close. Just got myself too close. And I, I think that's what uh, Cathy Johnson's talking to him about. If we just took it round and gave a bit more space, then there'd be a lot of room for you, it'd be safer. Spins were super for me. Yeah, just a question mark on the first spin. I'm not sure he got the levels on that. Oh, that could be a level three spin. Yeah, looking down, level three on the uh, the camel spin, but uh, all 